Hey guys, welcome back to The Untidy Artist. Today I'll be showing you how to make a basic hair bow. This is a really easy hair bow that requires absolutely no sewing and is fun to put on a headband or a clip. Let's grab our supplies and get started. The first thing you'll need is some one and a half inch grain ribbon and then a coordinating ribbon that's three eighths of an inch. Some scissors and a ruler something to seal the ends of the ribbon with, so I'll be using a candle and a match, and my trusty glue gun set on low. And then whatever you'd like to attach your bow to, I'll be putting mine on a headband. I got these at Hobby Lobby. Okay, so our first step. The first thing we'll do is measure out our ribbon. So take your one and a half inch grow grain ribbon and measure two pieces out to eight inches each. And then take your three eighths of an inch ribbon and measure out about three and a half inches. Once you have these measured, we're going to heat seal the edges of the ribbon. So I just like to use a candle and a match. You can also use a lighter, whatever works best for you. And you're just basically sealing the ends of the ribbon so it doesn't unravel. So be sure to seal the ends on all three pieces of your ribbon. And once you have that done, the next step is to shape our bow. So grab one of your eight inch pieces of ribbon, fold it directly in half, and then press on the fold, press it down firmly. I'll even use my fingernails so you crease the ribbon so that when you open up your ribbon, you can see a line and we're gonna use that line as a guide. So we're going to put a little line of glue on the side of the line and then take your ribbon and fold it up and over and firmly press it down and then you'll do the same thing on the other side. Now we're not going to overlap our ribbon at all. Just use that middle line that you folded into the ribbon as a guide. And once you've glued both of the sides down, the next step is to add some shape to our bow. So here you can see the back side of the bow. Here's the front. Turn it to the back side where you've just pressed and glued down the ribbon. And you're going to fold it in half Make sure that the ribbon is folded in half evenly and lined up. And then I take a little dab of glue and just put right inside where you've just pinched the fold. And you just need a little dab in there and then pinch it firmly until the glue sets. And now you're going to do an accordion fold on each side to fold the two edges down. So you can see we're pinching it. I'm gonna flip it over here to make this a little bit easier. We're gonna put a little dab, and then you're gonna fold up those two sides. Pinching it firmly. Fold up your other side, and this gives your bow shape. So once you've done that to one of the bows, go ahead and follow the exact same steps for your other eight inch piece of ribbon. And once you have both of them done, we are going to actually stack them on top of each other. So making sure that both of the bows are facing forward, take a little bit of glue, make sure it's lined up evenly, and you're just going to press the middle of the bows together pinching firmly and you've got this really cute bow that required no sewing. Now our last step is to just apply the center to our bow. So starting from the back, put a dab of glue, take your 3 8 of an inch ribbon, make sure it's lined up in the middle, press it down firmly and you're going to take it, wrap it towards the front, up and around. I like to put another dab of glue at the top of the bow to just hold that into place. But before you glue the back, before you glue any more down on the back, you're going to grab your headband or your clip or whatever you'd like to put this on. And I like to measure up, figure out where you want the bow to sit on your head. I measure up about five inches and then put a big dab of glue on the back of the bow, lay down your headband, and then while the glue is still wet, fold the, the piece of ribbon up and around the headband and then you're gonna wrap that middle piece of ribbon around just one more time. I put another dab of glue just at the top there and then on the back again to securely hold it into place. 
And ta-da, that's it. You have this really professional boutique style bow that required no sewing. And they're fast and easy to make. If you have any comments or questions, please post them below. I would love to hear from you. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And if you haven't already subscribed, please do. Thanks guys, we'll see you next time.